Second down seven. Play action. Corral. Oh my goodness, Elijah Moore wide open. Clay Kimber just threw his clipboard 30 yards in the air. Touchdown Ole Miss. What a play. Kimber celebrated this like it was New Year's Eve. You might see the clipboard fly up. And who is not in the picture right there? The safety. What did I just mention? Roderick went to the sideline. This week, not so much early. Corral has time to throw, lost it up, going for the end zone. Touchdown, Rebels. Is having some kind of day. I mean, he literally sat back there and made a sandwich inside the pocket there, Dave. I mean, he had all day, he patted it a couple times. He's so comfortable and he runs what we call a sluggle, slant and go. And the corner, Randall Haney, who they were excited. Needs to get guys on campus and develop relationships and that'll come in time. Matt Corral pumps, goes deep, and is able to connect. And it's Elijah Moore again. One of the most dangerous playmakers in the SEC is having himself a day. You know, I'm an experienced back judge, as you know. That's true, you are. Corral running out of time. Now zings one oh, over the catch. middle, and it's caught. Sandlot ball works for the rim. That's why they're taking a look at it. Low throw. That's Not only does he catch it, he doesn't lose his balance, and he's able to run for the first down. I mean, that is an incredible athletic play by Elijah Moore. State wanted intentional grounding. Corral facing a second and 17. He's going to unload. He's got more, and he's got the catch in another huge play. I never understand how that guy gets open, but it happens all the time. On his door, he immediately threw out when you brought that up. Yeah, man, 124, 17, 27, and 31. The numbers that Amari Cooper. It's more moving back and forth. Corral looking that way. Touchdown! The end zone. Third goal to go situation of the game. He throws it. Corral does more with the catch for the touchdown. Down 105 yards. This is on the line. Pressure comes. Corral gets it away. Going to the corner of the end zone. Touchdown, Ole Miss. And who else? Elijah Moore. The injury to Corral. Third and 19. Corral, time to wind up. And he does it. What a strike. And finding an in cutting Elijah Moore. And a bad throw leads to an interception. Can't do it. Elijah Moore rips this one up the hashes and he takes it into South Carolina territory on the first snap of this drive for a gain of 22. This offense is running through eight tonight. Corral after the play fake, throwing deep, has a man open, caught by Elijah Moore. Double coverage, watch the route, watch him go inside, influence the safety, then right up the field. Saw Jalen Waddle run the same route last week. And then there's the pressure packages that he wants to use. I think Odin's had enough time to make some calls, have an impact on this game. That was a great throw across the middle. Catch and run for a big gain, Ole Miss. There's Elijah Moore into Arkansas territory. Uh, no, Nizing and diagnosing the coverage. Corral downfield, and he finds Moore. And Elijah Moore is weaving, and he's inside the 20. Coach, nine years at Baylor for Art Bryles. Actually, that married Coach Bryles' daughter. There's Corral over the middle, and they've turned it into a makeable left of Matt Corral. Moore goes in motion. They'll tap pass it to him. He's trying to stretch it to the end zone, and why not? He's done everything else today. Well, that's a green chase, Archie. Corral steps up in the pocket. Over the middle. Caught. Touchdown. Ole Miss. There's a data point. He knows where he wants to go with the football, but he's looking left, steps up left, and looking at the safety. Jamie Robinson was playing over the top.